morning guys welcome to today the second last day of horse camp thank the lord because this girl needs some rest um been getting up at 6 a.m no 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 yeah. No, I've been getting up at 6 a.m. You've been getting up at 7 a.m. Just putting the doggies away, putting Dobie's diaper on. They just came in and we are headed out the door. Guys, I did this horrible mistake. A pet cookie. And then I started to turn my back and walk away. I said, Hi, Co Hi Toby. When I meant cookie. <laughs> That's so funny. Where's the boy growls at? Yeah, he does growl, huh? He's, he's like, give me my girls! Yeah, he's, he's like all super... Innocent yeah. Until... He's so cute, though. The stupid thing, I washed Cookies. it and now it won't stay up. Cookie. I'm missing. Look at Toby. Okay. He's all innocent. And then he's once he gets his girl in there, he thinks he has to protect the world. It's coming. Take away his girl, and he's all good. He's cute. <laughs> he is cute. You put his girl in there, and then he has to protect her. <laughs> he never ever used to bark before. Look, he only looks at Gabby. Hope he's doing much better today. Just a little bit stiff, right? She's secretly a mermaid, and you guys don't even know. With no fin, right? You do. I forgot deodorant. Gabby forgot her deodorant, and so luckily Mama packs it in a bag. No, it's mine. You forgot deodorant too? All right, you guys can put deodorant on. That's what happens, guys, when you're up at the crack of dawn. Okay, eight, seven o'clock, which feels like the crack of dawn. We have been having the worst time getting footage on this GoPro. Today is the day. Oh, sit on my head. Yeah, this does not fit her. But I have the, a green helmet. Yeah, does it go with, on? With the thing on it. Okay. So all you have to do is pull that out. Okay, grab the green helmet. But today's Gabby's day. Today Gabby's gonna wear it. Tomorrow Sophie's gonna wear it, right? Grab the yeah. green helmet. No, it's not. Oh, it's here. So you can wear the green helmet. People wanna see some. Because they have the thing on it. Okay. Let's so see if it fits. Yeah, put it on her. Let's see if it fits. Then there will be no excuses. Uh, they've also had technical difficulties with it. There it goes. Perfect. Walmart now I'm not gonna lie being home the last whole week has kind of been a little bit boring even though I've got a lot done so I'm gonna pick up all the last minute stuff that I need for school that's gonna start in like 12 days or something um yeah so I'm gonna shop by myself and it's gonna be awesome
day after I let Toby out, I put his diaper on and I give him a little pep talk. Toby, don't pee, okay? Be a good boy. You don't need to spray everything. Don't pee on anything, okay, Toby? Okay? You got it? Wag your tail. Wag your tail if you got it. Be a good boy. Be a good boy. It's 20 to 11. I can't even believe the time is flying. Uh, it's time for me to have a break. I've been working hard trying to get the upstairs cleaned. Mostly at my room, Sophia's room. And I'm still waiting for Sam to put together the trundle bed in the spare room. Um, oh, apparently something I said meant to the dogs come running to me quickly. Toby! Come here, Toby! Come on, Toby! Come here! He's afraid of he's afraid of getting stepped on for sure. Ruby, go lay down. Go lay down. You guys don't know this, but Ruby misses everybody. She's not that close with me. Ew, she just gave me a gross kiss though. Okay. Toby. Come on, Toby. Come on. Come on. Come on, Toby. You're so close. Come oh, Ruby. At nighttime, Toby comes to me like that because it's either come to me or be alone walking around downstairs because the girls are sleeping with the other dogs. So he comes to me just like that. It's only daytime that he's like, no, I'm not into you today. Um, anyway, I thought that while I have a break, I'll share with you guys some of the stuff that I bought for homeschool this year. I am still in huge homeschool mode. Um, and this is Gabby's vocabulary book. It's about to be Gabby's vocabulary book for grade six. Um, and these are some things that, like in here, I have, I photocopied all this. This is Sophia's book report. So every time she reads a book, and we read a lot of books in homeschool, she'll have that page. And then there's another page in it. Um, after she's done the actual book report, it'll be two pages together and it'll look like a book. Super cute. I got this amazing book this year. It's grade three, four. Sophia's going into grade four. It's file folder games and basically it takes all of her reading and all of her math skills that she needs and it turns them into a game. So this is, uh, let's find a better one. So uh, basically this is a math game and she'll cut out all of these things and she will glue them to a file folder and it will become a game. She'll be able to turn all these skills into games. This is super cool. It turns uh, learning into a, eclectic learning, which is super good hands-on learning. Um, so I needed to buy a whole thing of file folders for her so that she can play some of those games. Every year I struggle with buying stuff for homeschool because I always want to buy new, fresh, amazing stuff. They always have new colors, new styles, new design, but everything that we have from last year is still awesome and works amazing. So I struggle and I end up at least buying a couple of new frivolous things. So I bought the girls these unicorn folders. I'm not sure what we're going to use them for, but I knew that they would love them. I needed duo tangs for Gabby's uh, school books this year, and I got all red. If I bought individual colors, they were 44 cents. If I bought red, they were 10 cents. So she's old enough, I think, to handle all one color. Um, I got new erasers, new glue sticks. These are probably one of the biggest staples of our homeschool, all these three things right here. I bought them each of those. I bought staples because we always need those and I bought them both highlighters. This is the year that the girls learn how to highlight what you use it for and how to make the best of it, how to get the most from it. Um, also, they had these really amazing agendas there. I need to put a brighter bulb in this room. Um, they had these really amazing agendas there and I'm so about the agendas. But I didn't buy them because my kids hate agendas and I was like, okay, whatever. They're not going to use them. So why waste money? Okay, so I also got markers for our whiteboard that you guys saw over there hanging up. Um, we are going to do an extensive um, unit on uh, the human body. So we got this smart lab thing that the girls are super excited about. We're going to really focus on health this this year, this first semester. Uh, we also are going to do chemistry. Woo, woo. Um, so this has 29 projects in it and 
comes with this amazing book and all these things. Probably like be cheaper just to, this was $30. It'd probably be cheaper just to buy those things myself. Um, but it has all the um, experiments and stuff that we do here. So we're going to be doing that this semester. I did buy them these workbooks. I bought them way before the new ones came out. The new ones like have way better patterns on them. I think um, obviously blue is Gabby and pink is Sophie. We also got these. I always wanted one of these. Have you guys seen these? It's a boogie board and it has a pen and it has a case and basically you write on it. And I really like this for um, spelling tests times tables anything that they have to remember like spelling words and stuff so if i test them i can be like what's five times five and then they have to write it on there and just uh, fun stuff like that i thought that um it would make learning much more fun and hands-on which is what my kids love um anyway so that's pretty much all that i bought except for their workbooks like i bought a lot of workbooks and stuff um for them you saw sophie's yesterday already put in her file folder i ordered gabby's yesterday so um i'll show you guys those when they come in i have a lot more curriculum books in these pockets here all gabby's are in here i haven't gone through them yet because the door's stuck another fun thing that we're going to do this semester so that stuff is all just until christmas all that stuff is just going to keep us busy until christmas um we're also going to to sewing so I got these two books and they have like super simple projects for kids to sew and we're gonna I'm gonna teach them to sew there's a sewing club where we live and I want them to join it and if so I am going to teach them I can teach them some basic stuff I know how to sew I have a sewing machine but I'm not super skilled so which is pretty much sums up my life I can do a little bit of everything but I am not super skilled so I think we're gonna try some of these projects that are super easy and if they really get into it then I'm going to make them join the, the sewing club because she can they can do it during school they can make pillows or bags or skirts but the really fun one I want to do is in this book dun, 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 dun. so I'm thinking about doing this with a video on it with a video with some of Gabby's friends this fall I think that would be really cool if we all made our own hobby horses, then we can do a video and everybody will have one. All right, so Gabby says we need this. Green Clean removes urine manure stains. Yuck. Yeah, it's actually very Gabby's riding her. Yeah. Gabby said, my her, and I said, Yeah, we're taking turns at exercising Stella, huh? Look, she's going to have fun, so I'm brushing. Look, it's even in her mane. It's even in her tail and on her booty. I'm always pa panicked when I see her. At least she's rolling. I don't know. Like, she's rolling. That's a fat pad, I think. All right. Any stain. Pick a stain. Any stain. Because there's a lot of them. Yeah, that's, that's a bad one. Dirt. All right, we're going to try this green clean. Try this spot. Oh, I forgot to tell you. She's afraid of... I just use my hand and it's like right off and it's like white. Wow, is it like soap though? Do you have to clean it, like rinse it? No, you just spray it on. Just... She's like, what are you doing? Mom, I put the hair net on all by myself. Oh, good. It works really well for shows. Yeah, that's I don't need neat. To brush anymore and then do you brush it? It feels like soap. Yeah. And then you let it dry and brush it? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. It stinks though. You get that green out though. Okay, thank you. Pretty it, it, it's only $12. It's only $12? <laughs> awesome. That's a deal. Mom, I'm trying to make stuff. I use black paint. Aw, I love it. That's what you made at camp? I can't hear anything in here, you guys. Look at my ears. Careful. Don't just whip it around her. I know, she's shedding. On her back. Yeah, I don't know. She has so much fat on her back, you could like slap it on her back. Yeah, but she's losing weight. weight, do you notice? Yeah, I can totally notice. Yeah, you can notice. Somebody she's else that hasn't seen her in a long time just saw her and said, wow, she's losing weight. Um, a bounce with no hands. You all did bounces? It was yeah. fun. It was fun. Was it? I did it with no hands, so I'm gonna jump two foot, but two foot with no hands. I'm like, no. Oh, it's cool. So oh, there's a show tomorrow. You guys didn't know that, but maybe you do if you've been following along because there's always a show at the end of camp. Anyway, I've been asking a couple of the girls if I can video them doing their jumps because I know some of you guys want to see Chloe jumping, so I'm going to ask her, but I know Kaylee said she can, I can video her. Meet Sabrina. We have Sabrina back. Kinda. Yeah, she has a black mane instead of a... 
She's a black mane instead of a chestnut mane. I love that you made Sabrina. That's so cool. Matt, I just got given an orange What's the name of your horse? Oh, my Norse. What? Uh, her name is um, Stella. Stella. So uh, Gabby is going to ride Estella today. We're all taking turns because it's too much work for just one person to exercise her five days. Um, and Stella does not like orange saddle pads. She had a little meltdown when Gabby brought it out. She's like, what the heck? Also, Farrier was in, and he was really happy with the healthy growth of her feet. So she. So yeah, they them. don't look awesome. I mean, they look better than before. They look better than before, and she's feeling a lot less pain on them. This might be it. This might be the day, Stella, that your girth fits without the extender, but it's not. I don't understand. Everybody keeps saying that you're losing weight, but you. She can puff out her stomach. No. Mom, May at no. horse camp says that she's not fat. Everybody at horse house because it's not nice to say she's fat. Even though she's... She says she's not fat. And she says, is she pregnant? No, she's not pregnant.
I decided to bring Stella down all by myself. There she is. I kind of want to try and bond with her better because I feel like she's lonely and lost. And I swear she had this plan. She was like, all right, since she's bringing me, I'm going to make her run for the grass. And she did it in a really sneaky move. She just kind of slowed down, looked around. And then when she thought I wasn't paying attention, she turned her head towards the grass and started to eat it. Didn't you, Stella? Now she knows that I'm not gonna let her, so she's walking a lot faster. She's like, fine, take me back to my bed. Right, Stella? Right, sweet girl? Anyway, so the vet was able to watch a video of her being ridden and he said there's a little bit of improvement. And so he's gonna start her on some medication. That'll start tomorrow. Right, sweet girl? I just stare at her all day though. I've loved, if we had our own farm, I would so put a hidden camera in her pasture and just watch her all day and see what she does. We are at, where are we? Montana. We're at Montana's for supper. We had to go do some running around. Pat said no to coloring on the table. Um, and Gabby is drawing a horse on the table. It looks horrible. Don't show me. Yeah. My, my two that I tried look horrible. Let's see. Don't. <laughs> you have to cut I'm it out. I'm gonna have to get this. Aw, it's a baby horse. It's a pony. No. I think I could draw a horse. I drew a giant. Oh, yeah. well, I'm gonna make a, um, a horse. Nice. Oh, that looks good. It's a sad day when the kids learn to like spinach dip. Do you like it? Because not that long ago they hated it and it was all for Sam and I, but now Sophie likes it. Look at that. Isn't that look so yummy? Eat the bread, eat the bread. So Sam and I got fajitas. I love fajitas. We got chicken and steak. And Gabby I'm got- saving these carrots for storm. It's cold in here right now. So Gabby got chicken wings. It's what she gets no matter where we go. So we got chicken fingers, right? Stop eating your daughter's food. I like actually the meat. I want too. <laughs> we are living in Well, I don't know No, I don't I don't know I don't How could I know what lies ahead of me? Am I part of a grand? Am I part of a And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below